Surprise, surprise, We're surprise. We're back in Vegas. The flights are open. Yeah, and this is one yeah. week before Christmas. Yes, it is. It's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, uh, little things that we have planned on this trip is a uh, burger. Burger throwdown. Yeah, like a gourmet burger mm -hmm. throwdown. Mm -hmm. So, so um, yeah. Hoping to eat a little bit better. I just got a root canal. So I'm she a little did. bit swollen. A little bit puffy. Yeah. So but, we'll see how it goes. Uh, we're going to try out um, Gordon Ramsay burger. Mm -hmm. Bobby Flay's and uh, who? Uh, Gordon Ramsay, Bobby Flay, and uh, Guy, 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 Guy Fieri's. Fieri's. Yes. Yeah. So it's going to be like a. We're like going to see Food Network slash Hell's Kitchen. Right? Yeah, yeah. So down. we'll see how it goes. It's going to be fun. So be uh, fun. it's about 9 o'clock, yeah. 9.30 at night. Yeah, grab a burger. Yes, yeah, so over here at Gordon Ramsay's yeah. Burger. Babe, yeah, yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah, you got our venues here yeah. and some drinks. There's our burgers. Here we go. I got the fat tire Belgium. I got the Santa cherry wheat. Santa cherry wheat. Cheers, babe. Little taste of Belgium from last week. Oh, that's really good. Is it good? Very good here. Yeah. It's good for your tooth. It's going to be good for my root canal. I got the farmhouse burger. A pork chop and applesauce burger. A pork chop and applesauce. Yeah. Pork, pork. Wow, look at that. Yeah, it's good stuff. Oh, look at the eggs. It popped right there. Oh, it did right pop. Now. It did pop. The farmhouse burger. Not to mention these beer battered onion rings. Comes with two different kind of dipping sauces. I'm not really sure what they are. Yeah. There we go. Good Here looking we go. bite. Good looking bite. Mm. Good bun. Very good bun. Meat's very tender. Not dried out. It tastes good. It's a good burger. Order for the farmhouse. A really good bite here. Good flavor. The bacon is a very crispy kind of bacon. Tasty egg. Good tasting beef. It's a good burger. This, this is a good start to the burger throwdown. Alright, I'll try these onion rings out. Mm. Put the batter on it. Very light and crispy. Mary, these are very good onions. How'd you like it, babe? It was really good. Yeah. Really good burger. Uh, in the farmhouse burger, the meat was a little plain, but it worked perfectly with the bacon because the bacon was really salty. Yeah, overall, I think it was a good burger. I wouldn't say it was a great good. burger. It was it a was good burger. It was just okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it was good. It was good, though. Yeah, it uh, was good. Uh, everything so, everything good we had was though. like 64 bucks. Yeah. With the onion ring, beers. two beers, right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so I think I think we're gonna call it at night tonight. Yes. It's getting kind of yes. late. Try to get this swelling down. Kind of, kind of hurts right now. So. Yeah. So we're looking forward to the two tomorrow. other burger throwdowns tomorrow yes. to see how it stacks up yes. against Gordon Ramsay. Alrighty, right? great. So great. You call me a grape? Uh, no, I didn't tell you a grape. Oh. Alrighty, guys. Good night. See you in the morning. See you in the morning. Morning. Good morning. Our second stop for this burger challenge is Guy Fieri's Burger Joint. Yeah. Well, no burger joint. It's called uh, Kitchen and Bar. Oh, sorry, Guy. Yeah, Fieri's Kitchen and Bar. Kitchen and, bar. and we are inside the Link Hotel. Yes, it's oh, at yeah. the. <clears throat> it's on the outside portion of the Link, right across from Harrah's. So yes. we're gonna go try their. Oh, burger um, out. just for last night, um, the uh, the Hell's Kitchen. No, not Hell's Kitchen. No, we went to Burger. Burger. Gordon Ramsay's burger. That was inside the uh, what hotel? The Planet Hollywood yes. in the Miracle Mile section. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we forgot to mention yeah. where that restaurant was. So this is our next one. Yeah, it's about uh, a little past 9 a.m. Yeah. So we're gonna see if they serve lunch this Hopefully early. Hopefully they do. And yeah. we'll we'll let you know. Two tacos, a Kobe burger. 
Right here we got the guy's bacon mac and cheese burger. This thing is a monster. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. There's my perfect bite. Yeah. There it goes. Good bite. Is it the Pekka Flavor Town? Mm, it's very good. Oh, is it? Is it? Yeah. Nothing like a good burger for breakfast, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> better. See the way the the burger is, it's just like the way it was on the, uh, the Carnival Cruise because burger uh, guy has a burger joint on the cruise ship. It kind of looks like that, like a hand foreign patty. Here we go now. Mm. That mac and cheese comes through really well. It matches really good. Look at that. This is a good burger sandwich. Guys, burger it review. It was very good. I very liked good. it. I liked it so far better than burger. It was a very good patty. Yeah, a little bit better than uh, Gordon Ramsay's. Mm -hmm. Um, so, so far, Guy is in the wind, so far. So far, so far. We have, one, we have one more one tonight. One more for sure, maybe two. We'll see if we can oh, see it Oh, I don't know, in. I don't know, because we yeah. do have dinner reservations tonight. Uh, lunch, so, yeah. like well, a late yeah, lunch. Yeah, a late lunch. Reservation. So, we'll try to squeeze in a burger yeah. later tonight, yes, which definitely. is Bobby Flay's. Yes, we have to try that one. Yeah, so far, Guy Guys. versus Bobby now. We'll see what yep. happens. But now we're off to the uh, outlet center, do some little bit of shopping. Yep. And hang out. We're at the Disney store, babe. Yeah. Look what I got for you. Oh, thank you. Oh, baby. Trying out the new Juniper Latte here at I Starbucks. I haven't tried it yet. Try that, babe. See if you taste some holiday cheer in there. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it tastes... Um, it does taste like gin. A little bit. Huh. Um, it has that juniper flavor. Uh, yeah, like, the Starbucks dude told us it probably tastes like gin, and it actually does taste like gin. It's good, yeah. though. Yeah. It kind of tastes like a tree, right? Tree and coffee. But a good tree. It's a sweet tree. It is. I like it. So she wants to give me this for Christmas. Yeah, I have but, to give him that hat. What do you it's think, like guys? Is it me? It's a yeah. little Russian, but... I have but to do it. Yeah, it's so him. Makes me want to have some vodka. <laughs> <laughs> All done Christmas shopping. All done. Look at that big we old bag you got. one more group. Oh, yeah, here it is. It's huge. Yep. Yeah. We have one more couple to shop for. Maybe we'll find something on the strip there. Maybe, but we're heading back to the hotel. Let's go. So we are actually on the way to Caesar's Palace. So yeah. we're gonna have a late lunch. Yeah, at, at Hell's a Kitchen. really cool place. Yeah, yeah Hell's yeah. Kitchen. We've never been there before. Yeah. And well, it's I think busy. it just opened uh, within the past couple of years, I believe. Yeah, it's been really busy, but right now, since it's a little time right now in Vegas, we found some reservations. So we're yeah. gonna go try that out today. At 3 30 today. Yes. So we're making on our, our way, way there. there now. Made it to Hell's Kitchen right here. Here it is. This is. Where we're having our late lunch. Yeah, it's right next to Caesar's Palace. You ready? Let's go, baby. Let's go inside. Let's go. We go. Yeah, it's Yeah. Okay. So they have a wide variety of things on the menu, but we're going to go for the Hell's Kitchen Express three course. It doesn't uh, need anything. It's like a little cracker and it has pumpkin seeds on top. Okay. Very good. We're with the uh, Las Vegas lager here. And I have a Hell's Kitchen. Yeah. 
here, Zay. Here you go. Very light. Heavy. Really? Yeah. It's a heavier one. Alright, our main entree here, the Deep Wellington. Looks kind of fancy out there. It's pretty looking. Yeah. Yeah. This is the back side of it. Yeah. <laughs> of course, this is, we both got the same thing. Oh yeah, here we go. Yeah, I felt Never fancy. Tried it before. Yeah. Be first time. Here we go right here. Wow, the meat is super tender. Um, the pa puff pastry, very good. Try some of this uh, mashed potato or puree. Very creamy. This is good, very good lunch. Yeah, medium rare is what they recommend it, yes. and they don't change it, so medium rare is how we got it. That's right. Very, uh, it's very pretty. Yeah, very tender. Yeah. Very tender. It's a very good presentation. Love it. Yeah. Okay, we got that sticky toffee pudding. Kind of looks like a hamburger patty. Yeah. Well, it's kind of interesting. Got, uh, ice cream on top. Yeah. That's what it is. Uh huh. Let's try it out. They actually turned down the lights here. That's why it's a little bit dark. Oh wow. It's very good. It's like cake. That's. Like what? It's cake. Oh, cake. Like soaked into some yummy goodness. Oh, Unbelievable. Right. What kind of, what flavor ice cream is that? The stripes. Kind of like a, a caramel. I've never had a, like oh, a, this type of caramel. Yeah. It's very good. In fact, it's hot because my ice cream is starting to melt yeah. already. Hell's Kitchen. That was very good. It wasn't yeah. very busy at all. No, the service was on point. The food was on yeah, point. Yeah, great, great server. Yeah, right? great server. Omar, great mm -hmm. server. So. Yeah, so full. Yes. But the, but the lunch um, amount was the perfect amount. Yes, and it's only like 4.30, 4 or 4.30 right now. Yeah. So about 9 o'clock, hopefully we'll squeeze in another burger for our last burger little throw down here. Yeah, uh, so, be warned, be it's, it's not a cheap place. It's, it's not. a little bit on the pricey side. Yeah, for our lunch, we got the prefix menu. For our lunch, after tip, it was uh, almost 200 bucks. Yeah, so almost. it's good for maybe just so you can try it to say you've been here, yep. you know. But yeah, it's a kind of a pricey little bre breakfast. It is. No lunch, I said breakfast. But you're worth lunch. it, babe. Oh, my thank you, baby. I love you, babe. Love you, babe. That was the corny part of the video. Yeah. Have you ever seen the uh, fur ornaments before? Fur ornaments, baby. Yeah, this is the first. Mm -hmm. We made it to the third and final burger throwdown. Yes, now we're gonna get ready to buy or try uh, Bobby's Palace. Bobby's Burger Palace. Yes. So we're wondering, this one didn't get as well reviews as the other one. Well, we'll so see. We'll see. You well, never know. Only because, you know, Gordon Ramsay Burger got high ratings and we thought it was, was just, just good. okay. Yeah. So you so never know. Let's go try it out. Let's go. Let's go inside. Now we're just going to try the uh, bacon crunch burger. Add-ons. We're going to go for that one. We have the bacon crunch burger. It's like a cheeseburger with potato chips in it. Presentation, it's not going to win any great awards, but we're going to see how it tastes. Looks good. Big old pickle. They have different sauces, but I'm going to have it naked. Yeah, there's like several sauces. Yeah, but I'm going to have it naked. Let's try it out. By design. Mmm, good bacon. Crispy, huh? Crispy. Good cheese. Oh, it's strong. Cooks very well. Uh huh. Very juicy. Yeah, we um, ordered it well done. Yeah, because 
We've seen past reviews and we usually get it medium. Or medium and well. It, and it's looked really still too red for us. Right. So we had it well done. It looks good. That's good. That's actually a really good burger. Really? It's like really juicy. If you can see the juices in the bread right there. It's juicy right there. Good size burger. Mm -hmm. Very meaty. It's a little bit on the saltier side, I'd say. But that's um, consistent with a lot of the reviews that I read on Yelp. That it is a little bit salty, but nothing too bad. Mm, good, I'm gonna finish this and give us the, the final review on it. Wrapping up that burger challenge. That was good. Now for me. First place goes to Guy Fieri's. Mm -hmm. I really like that combination of uh, the, the mac and cheese, mm -hmm. uh, the hand form meat, you know, patty. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. And, you know, the fries were a bonus, but we're not really rating the fries. What's kind of interesting with the Guy Fieri fries is that there are three different types of fries in there. There was, there was. On the video, I, I know I showed two, but there was actually three times. these large wedged potato fries yeah. at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and se second place. Okay, oh, baby. Yeah, second place for me goes to. Um, Gordon Ramsay, that farmhouse burger. I I, I like that one. A second, now third over here at Bobby Flay's. Um, it, I would consider a very safe burger. They did put a lot of salt in it. Um, I don't think it's anything more than you would order at a, at a diner yeah. kind of burger place. But it was overall it was good, and, and the price point was very good. It was yeah, only like, like ten fifty, right? Yeah, 10 compared for the to burger. the other three. But you know, uh, money aside, <laughs> it still came in third yeah. regardless. So that was my list. Yeah. What about for me? Yours? It was Guy Fieri. I love that flat, that hand formed patty, which was very good. Then this one I like actually Bobby Flay a little bit better than Gordon Ramsay because I like the salt. This it wasn't too salty for me but it was just perfect for the burger. And then Gordon Ramsay was the last one for me. Uh, it was very good, but I thought the patty was just too plain for me. Mm. So that was my list. So had they put some special sauce on it, it would have yeah. changed the outcome. Yes, definitely. But, but we did have it per design, yes, right? Yes, we did. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so yeah, that wraps up our burger challenge. It is, it does. So is that it, baby? No, no, no. We're still going to go look around tonight. Okay. But, but that's it for the burger challenge. Yeah, burger challenge is done. It was. Yes. It was fun. It was fun, baby. Yeah. Look at that. Her boobies are It's called fashion. Look it up. Hey, it's pretty, babe. Yeah. Ah. Awesome. Yeah. Got our first frozen drink. Yeah, it's a party now. How much was this, babe? It's $16.95 before tax. But then when you get these cups, you can come back for refills anytime. Just remember your cup any day. So when you come back to Vegas, just bring your cup and then you can pay like 11 bucks for a refill. Yeah, we got a mix of uh, pina colada and strawberry. Yeah, how is it, baby? Good, and he put like an extra shot of rum or something. Or something yeah. Right? That's good, he's trying to boost us up. You want out of that big yeah, 30, half a 30 cent, 30 cent bet. Not bad. 25, 26 bucks. Fun, fun weekend. That was a fun weekend, baby. Didn't think we were going to come back to Vegas, but flights were open. Yeah. Rooms were cheap. For sure, this yeah. was our last Vegas trip before the New Year. Before the New Year, yeah. Next week being Christmas. And the week, following week will be New Year's. That's so right. That's we're right. gonna stay far away from Vegas on those days. So. Right. I think we right. might even stay local next week as yeah. well. Yeah, yeah, we will. I'm so sure the, we'll 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 make yeah. some vlog, but it'll be in somewhere LA, else. Yeah. yeah. So the burger throwdown was yummy. Mm -hmm. So that was a lot of fun. A little bit of Christmas that we did. Christmas little, shopping. Yeah, a little Christmas day. shopping, and so it was a very fun trip. It was. But we're ready to go sleep and we got a flight in the morning. That's right. So, so. Uh, all of our viewers, uh, thanks for watching a the whole holidays. year. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Happy New Year to everybody. Yep. We'll catch, catch you guys on the next one. Bonus footage. Yep. Bonus footage. <laughs> in the Link uh, Promenade, I think it's called the Link yep. Promenade. It is. Pretty Christmas tree. They have shows here. Yeah. Yeah. That's where the this is where the in and out is too. It's right behind this. Yep, it's seven o'clock in the morning yep. and we're gonna have some breakfast before we head to the airport. Yes. So we're gonna try out Cantors. Cantors. Yeah, well uh, remember Cantors from our uh, pastrami throwdown yeah. in Los Angeles? Yes.
They have one location here in Vegas. Breakfast came, pastrami eggs benedict with some home potatoes. Really good. What you get, babe? I got the corned beef hash, whoops, oh. which is like the perfect one I like, which is like the cheap kind. Yeah. This is perfect with eggs and toast. Nice, and then a side of fruit. And a side of fruit. Oh, it's really tender. You can just tell. This is like the same pastrami that they have in the sandwiches. First time I've had pastrami eggs benedict and I'm glad I waited till I came here. It's really good. Look at that, you can tell it's the same pastrami that sandwiches use. Let's try this corned beef out. See it is the kind that I like. Oh yeah. It looks good. Is that potato? Nicely cooked. Yeah, it has, does have potato in there baby. Mmm, very good. Is it like the canned Libby's? It's not like the canned Libby's one. It's much more fresh. Uh, yeah, that's good. It tastes like house-made corn, house corn beef. Very good. Winner. Winner. Breakfast was awesome. That was really good. Yeah, uh, if you ever try the eggs Benedict here, it's a little bit of heat to it. I saw a little bit of cayenne. It's slow heat, but it wasn't bad at all. In the holiday sauce. Yeah, and uh, your so, corned beef hash. It was very great. good. Yeah. It was really good. Now nice we, and full. Yeah, we're ready, full. Ready to go back on the plane, go back home, baby. We are. Now we're officially going to wrap up yes. our Vegas trip. Yes, thank you for watching this little bonus video. Bonus, bonus. Mm -hmm. we'll guys, catch you guys on the next one.